Hi. Hi, I'm Laura. What's your name? Hi, Margaret. It's nice to meet you. How old are you? Great. Well, I'm so glad you're here today. So, Margaret, what are we going to learn about? Yeah, we're here to learn about horses. That's right. So, do you have a horse? I don't have a horse either, but I love horses. I love to learn about them. Why do you like horses? Yeah, they are fast. What's your favorite kind of horse? You like Arabians? Yeah, those are pretty. Do you like to draw them? Me too. Well, I don't draw them very well, but I like to try. Okay, well today we're going to learn about horses and I have a little book up, a little book for you. We're going to learn about what horses need. So what are some things that you already know that horses need? They need food. What else? How do we keep a horse healthy? Water. Mm -hmm. do, you, do you need to exercise a horse? Yeah, you sure do. That's right, so we're gonna learn some things that horses need, and then at the end, you'll get to show what you know, okay? All right, so here we go. Share my screen, and then we're gonna go to present mode. Yeah, you see the horses? <laughs> All right, so here we go. What is the title of this book? That's right, what do horses need? Very good. Okay, so, will you like the gray horse? That's right. Okay, here we go. This is our first word. This is pasture. Have you heard this word before? How, what is a pasture? What do you see? I don't know. Well, what are the horses eating? Yeah, they're eating some grass and we call a big piece of grass a pasture. Yeah, that's right. So let's read this. That's right, graze. What does graze mean? That could mean to eat. So the horses graze in a pasture. Yeah, very good. All right, here's our next word. What is this? That's right, hey, oh, Margaret, we have somebody else coming in. Come on in, Ellie. Hi, Ellie. Ellie, how are you today? Welcome to class. I'm glad you could join us. We're talking about that's okay. I'm glad you're here. Uh, well, we're talking about horses and what they need. So Ellie, what do you see? Yeah, this is a horse and what is it eating? That's right, it's eating some hay. What is hay? Yeah, it's dried grass. That's right. So we were showing Margaret or Margaret and I were talking about a pasture. So if a pasture is green grass, why would a farmer need hay for the horse? It tastes different. Yeah, it does. When would a farmer give a horse hay? Yeah, maybe in the winter. Mm -hmm. That's right. Very good. So um, Ellie, can you read this sentence? That's right. Excellent job. Okay, let's go over here. This word is minerals. Can you guys say that? Minerals, that's right. What is the horse doing, Margaret? Yeah, what do you think that is? What is in the ground? What, did you know that horses need salt? So Margaret, can you read the first sentence? And Ellie, you can read the second sentence. So look at it, ready? Go. Oh, what does this say? 
Minerals. Minerals. Very good. Ellie, can you read? Earth. Earth. Yes, that's right. Very good. Awesome. So what is the horse eating or licking? So, yes, that's right. They need some salt. Okay. What do you see in this picture? Yeah, companion. Companion, good. I, wow, Ellie, I'm so glad you knew the word companion. That's awesome. So Margaret, what do you think a companion is? Yeah, it's like a friend. That's right. So Margaret, can you read this? Yeah. So Ellie, who are some of your companions? They're the best friend. Yeah, Margaret, I, Penelope, she's your companion. <laughs> Very good. Awesome. Well, horses need friends too to stay healthy. Did you know that? Yeah, that's real important. Okay, and then this word has, ooh, groom, yeah. How do you groom a horse? What do you use? What's this? Yeah, you use a, a soft brush. There are a lot of different brushes and tools, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay, so here's your sentence. So I, I'm going to show you, and I want you to look and think before you say it. Okay, ready? Let's look at it. Read it to yourself. What's this part? Very good. She will groom. This is sure. Very good. Okay, Margaret, can you read it? Yes, Ellie, why is it important to groom a horse? It feels good. Yeah, do you like when your mom brushes your hair? Some, I know, my mom always made my hair, made my head hurt. <laughs> yeah, but the horse, it gets off all of the dirt, right? Very good, guys. Okay, so let's go over here. What is this word? One. Two, three, tell me. Yeah, exercise. Awesome. Great job. Okay. That's right. You guys read it so well. Okay. So let's read it together. Go. Very good. That's right. Can you think of another way to exercise a horse? Do you think they might like to swim? Maybe. Okay, so let's go over here. This is our book. So what I want you to do, yeah, what I want you to do is to think about um, things that horses need as we read. So each page is about something that a horse needs. So let me go over here and let's look at our pictures. What do horses need? What's the title? That's right, they need healthy food. That's really important. So every page has a horsey fact right here, okay? So Margaret, can you tell me what maybe some good snacks for horses could be? That's right, yeah. Do you like these snacks? Sometimes. All right, so Ellie, can you read this? Very good. So Margaret, what are some good snacks for a horse? Yes. And this is a word, I don't know if you know this one. This is trough, a trough. What does the horse say? Margaret, can you read? <laughs> this is oats, yes. Yeah, like your oatmeal. They like this. Very good. Okay, and then we have over here. What are they, what are they licking? What's this? Do you remember what the mineral that is in the ground? Okay, so I'll 
salt lick because they lick it. That's right, Margaret. Good job. Oh, so Ellie, what is something we need to make sure that horses get in their food or from the ground? They need yeah, they do. They need salt because it's it helps them to stay healthy. So here we go. Um, Margaret, why don't you read this? We'll just switch off the sentences, okay? So go ahead. This is natural. Start again. Good, Ellie. Pasture. That's right. Margaret? Very good. That's right. And Ellie? Break it down. Veg. Vegetables. Yes. Okay. All right, Margaret. We have this word, minerals. And this is especially. So let's try this. Here. Summertime. Yeah, so why do you think they might need salt in the summertime? Oh, because they get hot. Did you know horses can sweat? So when they sweat, they lose a lot of salt. Yeah, that's why they need some in their food. Well, here are some things that are not good for horses, okay? So we say, no, do not eat them. All right, they're not good for horses to eat. What is that? Brownies. Why do you think horses can't have brownies? Too much sugar, yeah, it's not good for their teeth. Here's another one. <laughs> hot dogs. Yeah, why can't horses have hot dogs? What do you think? Um, well, do horses eat meat or are they supposed to eat vegetables? Are hot dogs such? No, they're not. No, I, I know your mom's. Well, I try not to give too many to my kids. You're right. They're not that healthy. Ooh, what's this one? It's a vegetable. Potatoes. Yeah, but... Um, that there are some vegetables that they can't have. And this is one of them, potatoes, very good. Okay, so let's see what else comes up. Did you know they can't have tomatoes either? Yeah, so these are some things that if you have a horse, you have to make sure they cannot eat. Very good, good job guys. Okay, so here's our next one. So, what is the title of this? Okay, this is a past, well, it has an ED on the end. So it's groomed, groomed, that's right. So what is she using to groom the horse? A soft grooming brush, that's correct, very good. Okay, and then let's look at our horsey fact, all right. Can you guys read this? Now, why do they groom each other? To show they care for each other, that's right. Why does your mom groom you? Like brush your hair, make sure your teeth are brushed, put clean clothes on you. Why does she do that? Yeah, to show that she cares, that's right. You help your sister, that's good. Yeah, that's really good. Okay, so this is another tool that we can use. I'm gonna show you this little video here, maybe. This is called a hoof pick. What is it getting? Like, why are they using the hoof pick? That's yeah, gonna take out, yeah, take out all those little rocks and things from the hoof, that's correct. All right, so let's, let's try this again. Um, we have the word, we're going to switch as we read, okay? So, do you know this word, Ellie? Important. Very good. So, Ellie, can you read this sentence? Good. Go ahead and read the next one, too.
Very good. All right, Margaret, your turn. Brushing, brushing. Good, Margaret, keep going. This is remove. Yeah, remove. Tangles, tangles, like when your hair is tangled. Chance to. Very good reading. Wow, that's excellent. Good work, girls. Okay. So we've talked about a few things that horses need. There are more and maybe we can get to more the next time. But first of all, um, let me see what is a pasture. Can you tell me, Margaret? Yeah, pasture is this place over here. Not that, sorry. What do the horses do? That's right. And Ellie, what is hay? Good, dry grass. Margaret, what are minerals? And Ellie, what's the mineral that the horse is licking? Good. What do they need? What is this? Yeah, they need a friend and something else they need is to be very good. And last, that's right, they need some exercise. Okay, so I'm gonna stop sharing this one. And what we're gonna do is go to a jam board. Okay, so let me get out of here. So we're gonna go over to this and you guys are gonna help me make a jam board. Okay, have you done jam board before? No, okay, well, I'm gonna send you a link to it in your chat. Here. Let me put this in the Zoom chat. And then I think perhaps you can get there. Let's see, where is our chat? Ah! All right, so here's the link. All right, so what you can do is click on that link and then you should be able to get into the jam board. Okay, so on this jam board, we have a picture of a horse and we have our vocabulary words here. Okay, so what I need you to do is you can, this is kind of cool, you can come over here and get a sticky note and you can write something that you have learned. Like maybe you want to write horses need exercise. And save it. Okay. And you can put a little post it note there. Ah, so go ahead, Ellie, Margaret. Can you guys make some post it notes? <laughs> Very good. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you for adding to the jam board. Very good. Okay. So I think I didn't share that. This is what it would look like. Sorry about that. Yes, yeah, so I would just have the students come in and hopefully they'd be able to get in. If not, then they could tell me what they'd like to put on their post-it note and I could add those. They could also, um, you know, if they were really savvy, then they could obviously draw or write or, or whatever they want to. It's just I just thought it might be a fun way for them to show what they know. Um, we could try. <laughs> all right, they could also use the Zoom tools to annotate on here if all else fails. So anyway, um, I'm gonna stop here. But that's my little lesson. That's uh, just a general lesson that I might do with kids to, to teach them about horses. Um, you know, and if they needed to go back and I saw that there were some, uh, some gaps in their learning about how to break down words or whatever, then that could obviously lead to like some word study skills or something like that for a later lesson. 
all right i hope this helps i hope you can see my teaching style and um i'll see you soon bye